We know that for many people, church is the last thing on their mind. In fact, maybe you're watching today and you would say your perception of the church or even your experience with the church has been more of a negative one. From day one, we have had a desire that Easttown would be a place where you can redefine what you think about the church. And more importantly, where you can redefine what you think about who God is in your life. My name is Clint Dupin. My name is Michael Dupin. And so we just want to welcome you into our backyard and say... This, and, it's not our backyard. I wish it was though. Yeah, if I you do wish too. it, maybe it would become it. I don't think that's going to happen. That's not true either. Mm -hmm. Okay. Anyways, hey, we know if you're watching this, you're probably checking out what's East Town about? What's Clint and Michael about? What is the whole community thing at East Town all about? So before we talk about what we do here at East Town, we just want to acknowledge that we kind of live in a crazy time, don't we? We live in a world that is broken, right? That is divided, where there is so much mental health issues. There's pain, there's hurt everywhere. That we're all battling. Yeah, yeah, that every one of them, I mean, myself included, right, is a part of that. We want to acknowledge that, but at the same time, we know that there is something that the church, that we believe here at Easttown, that can start changing that, right? Not just about us personally, but it can also start changing the landscape of the communities in which we live, uh, the homes, the neighborhoods, the workplaces, our social spaces. It really can change those things. Yeah, and we believe that as you connect here at Easttown, it can be a place where you can kind of find some relief, that you can take a deep breath from all that's going on in your world, and you can find a way forward with God that we believe offers more peace, more joy, more hope than you might be experiencing right now. One of the simplest ways to connect um, would be on a Sunday morning at Easttown, which you can start with us in person on a Sunday morning, or you can watch for a while online. It's always fun when I end up meeting someone in person and they're like, I've been watching online for like two years. Yeah. We know it's hard to walk into a new space. And I'll tell you what, what can you expect in that space is something that we believe that is encouraging to everyone, something that you will learn that you could apply to your life right now that potentially could change your life, right? Yeah. And so whether it's with your kids, we have Easttown Kids, which is a lot of fun. We have Easttown students that meet on Sunday night. And then we have a lot of other things that are going on as well. Yeah. But what about, what, what's something else? So then the next place, which again is another one of my favorites, but I would say is our Easttown groups. It's like no matter what- Let's say, we... let's say the phrase, we are better together. See how wow. we did that together? That That's really, we're, we're in line. really corny. But we do believe we're better together. And so in any way we can, we're always looking for ways to make the community of Easttown smaller. How can you gather in smaller groups in order to have more meaningful conversations? And so we have groups that meet in homes throughout the week. We have groups that meet at Fieldwork, which is a local brewery, whatever it might be, where we can provide places for you to connect into relationship. Last but not least, the thing I love the most is Love Local, right? It's like, it's if we start where we we live, we start where we work, we start where we play, we believe that things can actually change. So how do we love those people, right? How do we invite them into our homes, around our tables, so that we can make the impact and live out the purpose that we were designed to do. So we have Love Local Partners. It's like, we want to be generous. We want to be known for our generosity. We want to give to those people who are making a difference here in the East Bay, whether it's with human trafficking, it's some local schools. Uh, it's I, I think about all the different things. I can't even talk about them all. I'll tell you what I'm excited about is meeting you in person, face to face. Hey, I have something to tell you. I know the film's not rolling anymore. I bought this backyard for you. You didn't. You I bought this house for you. You didn't. I bought that fireplace over there. <laughs> we already have a fireplace. Can you take this chair? <laughs>